guys! Oh, too excited. It's the time of the... How do I say this? I'm doing another Halloween haul. I wasn't going to do another one of these so soon, but I got a few bits and pieces. If you follow me on Twitter, you'll see I tweeted about going to the supermarket to buy food and then not buying any actual like proper meals because I got distracted by the Halloween aisle. One thing from ASOS and the rest is generally from my supermarket. So the first thing I got is a dress and I got it from ASOS and oh my god, oh holy crap. If you search the word Halloween on the ASOS website, you get so many pretty things. I've had quite a bit of coffee. I've had quite a bit of coffee. I've had quite a bit of coffee. So let's get started before I like talk for like literally five minutes. It's been nearly two minutes already. Not by the time I edit this. <laughs> a dress from ASOS for £25. Ta-da! It's got little skeletons dancing on it. How freaking cute is that? It's by a brand called Worn By. Blah, 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 blah. And it's got two shades of blue. I don't know if you'll be able to see it that well. It's got like a lighter blue and then a slightly darker blue in like almost a tie-dye effect. And then it's got a ruched, ruched, is that the right word? Waist, or you know, whatever, whoever you want to call that. Yeah, it's not actually that long, I will say that much. It kind of looks long with me going like that, but it's not that long. Some kind of spooky long necklace, black leggings, and my spiked knee-high boots. Probably, that is how I would, what's the word, style this. So that's the first item. That is the only, like, clothing item. And then we've got a big orange bag. Sainsbury's. Okay, so the first item is gonna get glitter every freaking wear, but I'll do it first because it's like on the top and huge. Now I have a story about this, about this item. Well, it's not a very interesting story, but I'll tell it anyway. Ah, ah how cool is that? How cool is that? I, oh, it changes colour. I did not know that. Oh my god. Oh my god. What next? What colour next? Purple red. I did not know that went all those colours. I thought it only went red. And now I have glitter everywhere. Eesh. So the story about this is like, it was in my shopping bucket, but, uh, shopping basket, it was the last one. And I was just, you know, wandering up and down the Halloween aisle, as you do. And this little boy is like looking around and he reaches his hand into my basket and strokes the pumpkin. Like I have food and stuff in here as well. My pumpkin. I did for a second think he was gonna like get it out of my basket. Oh, I might put him on my makeshift little side table back there actually made of um, Marvel collectible boxes. I only got a few more pieces. I'll save my favourites till last. I got this banner, which I'm gonna hang above my bed there. Happy Halloween. I also got some orange glitter tea lights. So I've got little like spider tea light holders. So I think that's gonna, that's where they're gonna live. I also got some nail wraps which are gonna be cool. And then my favorite things, pumpkin skeleton. Dude, have you broken your foot? Not only is it a just a smart pumpkin skeleton in a tuxedo with a fancy bow tie and no bottoms, I got his freaking bride. <laughs> I love these so much. Spook and sparkle. How amazing. Are they? Like seriously. Pumpkin skeletons. So yeah, that was all I got for this haul. I've got two t-shirts coming, a cushion, um, and there's gonna be more stuff. I hope you enjoyed this video. Second Halloween haul of the year. If you have a moment, give it a big old thumbs up. If you're not already and you'd like to be, hit that button down below and subscribe. I'm also on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Links are below in the info box as well. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and I'll see you next time. See ya!